My name is Celine Condorelli, and I am an artist. I am sitting within the exhibition called Host. Host consists of uh, a large-scale curtain installation that will stay in Gallery 1 over a period of almost a year. And Host will host uh, a number of things. Firstly, a film program about climate change and migration, as well as it will also be used for a number of Kunstler Aarhus exhibitions and events in the period following my exhibition slot. The curtain is, um, is a very large curtain in four parts of different sizes that uh, host different shapes. The shapes are somehow windows or framing devices. Now, I, I consider curtains to be, in general, framing devices, meaning uh, they often um, create boundaries between, for example, day and night in, in, in houses, or between inside and outside, between private space and public space. And as such, they frame the activities that happen in one space or another. So the curtain acts, for me, as a double framing device, a framing device for Gallery One, in which it can wrap around and host or contain a series of events, but it's also a framing device through those windows to uh, the issues of climate change and migration that are therefore present in the institution for a long period of time. I call the curtain a drawing because curtains, of course, are like rather unsubstantial things that uh, behave much like paper. And in this case, it is the unfolding of uh, a key text on modernism, which uh, was the proposal of Le Corbusier for Paris, Le Plan de Paris, Le Plan Voisin, in which he proposed a radical rethinking of the city of Paris, uh, which involved a very large uh, part of the demolition. Uh, Corbusier used this uh, clever way of highlighting pieces of the text in his book with his painted uh, watercolor blobs or shapes, like highlighting devices. And because of the position of this text and the fact that I think thinking about climate change today means rejecting quite a large part of the modernist definitions of both society and man's relationship to culture, you know, like who's man and what is culture, um, I've kept the framing devices but to frame an entirely different position and an entirely different set of issues from that. In my practice for a number of years, I've been looking at and in, really interested in the apparatuses of visibility that allow us to encounter the world without thinking about it. Um, for example, framing devices or display devices in an exhibition context, since this is where we are now. Uh, those practices or objects and practices associated with them that allow us to understand where the painting starts and ends, how things are displayed, that light things. So all of the political unconscious of the exhibition context is specifically my territory for working in. This curtain is a framing device, meaning it is something that can go to the background, recede to the background and almost disappear in support of a film program. It can just provide a context, or it can also be looked at as a, as a practice in itself. But in this case, the curtain supports very much the presence of uh, this issue that is very important to me at the moment of climate change in relationship to migration through a program of films that uh, I have collected over the last year and a half, uh, to a large part with uh, film curator Filipe Ramos. Uh, and all of those films are made by artists and offer an empathetic look of what it means to inhabit a changing planet uh, within a warming climate, which changes the conditions for humans, of course, but for landscape and animals alike. Um, they're all poetic suggestions, um, readings, of what this changing reality could be. Um, 
And I think as such, they make these issues present in a way that allows quite an intimate, intimate encounter with issues that are so enormous as climate change and migration.